They say you cannot have something from nothing. But a tech company says they actually could pull out a solution to the water supply issues out of thin air. Bim Santos with the story. Millions around the world have no access to safe drinking water. And millions, millions of plastic materials are polluting the environment. These two problems are not alien to the Philippines. But Arizona-based Zero Mass Water might just have the right solution. These solar hydro panels are the first of its kind in the country. What it does is it extracts water from air, a technology that the proponents are hoping to deploy in rural areas in the country. The company has installed the technology in a number of countries like the U.S., Australia, Jordan, and Peru. In the Philippines, Zero Mass Water first installed its panels at the rooftop of the Asian Development Bank in Ortigas. Each panel can produce up to 5 liters of water a day and, by the company's estimate, it takes out the need for up to 50,000 plastic bottles. They take sunlight and they drag air inside and produce perfectly clean water from just the sunlight and air alone. So no electricity in, no pipe in, water produced totally renewably almost anywhere in the world. Each panel costs $2,000 on top of a $1,000 installation fee. But the company said the technology can be used in any location, regardless of humidity, atmospheric condition, and even pollution. So we will now have a taste of the water produced from the solar hydro panel. It's quite perfect for this uh, quite uh, hot weather. It's a little bit like, you can think of it as Manila air in a glass. So it tastes just like any normal water. With ADB, the National Electrification Commission, and local private partner Green Heat, Zero Mass Water said 40 hydro panel units will soon be deployed to eight island communities in the country that are most in need of potable water. ADB is very open to consider all new technologies. If we have supported uh, Zero Mass Water, it's among many, many things we are doing, and we're happy we will continue. And this is uh, a way ADB will remain relevant in development business. The proponents also plan to install more panels in schools, hospitals, and community centers in hopes of providing better access to potable water out of thin air.